The Bridgegate trial is over, but the controversy continues. The Port Authority is taking steps to dig into testimony from the six weeks in court. The Port Authority is not conducting an investigation into Bridgegate or its aftermath. Instead, the Operations Committee of the Port Authority, which is the sole committee under our bylaws that has personnel management functions, has asked outside counsel and the general counsel to conduct within 90 days a review of the Bridgegate testimony with respect to every current employee or board member of the Port Authority. Chairman John Degnan said steps could include things like a whistleblower statute, a revised code of ethics, and a commitment to increase transparency. Port Authority Executive Director Pat Foy said the Bridgegate controversy has had a lasting impact on the agency. Bridgegate was an incredibly uh, sad, uh, profoundly disturbing uh, episode for the uh, for the Port Authority. Over the same period of time, the Bi-State Agency has come to loggerheads over competing projects and how to fund them. So much so that one top appointee didn't come to today's board meeting, stoking rumors of a resignation. Steve uh, Cohn was with us today uh, for reasons related to his frustration with negotiations over the capital plan including issues with respect to the uh, uh, to the bus terminal. State Senator Loretta Weinberg took the mic during the board meeting to renew focus on the aging Port Authority bus terminal. People complained about leaky ceilings, unclean bathrooms, unbearable heat, barely mitigated by tiny portable fans. Most people con complained, however, that they could not count on the bus to get to work on time. Pretty simple requests. Weinberg expressed her dissatisfaction with a letter signed by Congressman Jerry Nadler and other New York elected officials urging Degnan to recuse himself from the Newport Authority bus terminal project, claiming the chairman, quote, skewed the terminal planning process, putting his personal priorities above the public interest and good governance. To suggest that Chairman Degnan is acting for political or personal reasons is downright insulting. Do you stand to gain financially from a new bus terminal? Absolutely not. <laughs> Chairman Degnan told the press assembled after the board meeting he thought the Port Authority was moving forward on the new bus terminal and that while he was disappointed in the setback posed by the letter, quote, we can overcome this. In Manhattan, Aaron Delmore, NJTV News.